Good evening, YouTube. This is Green. I'm tears coming to you on Green TV, also known as Katrina. So, day 19 through 22 of National Sewing Month 2012. So, I didn't get much sewing done other than completing the bodice to this dress, but I did accomplish finding some fabric to make this dress and a couple other garments for National Sewing Month. So, um, without further ado, let me show you the fabrics. So, some of the fabrics you haven't seen, some you have. So, I'm just going to um breeze right through so this is the fabric i'm going to be using <clears throat> to make that dress with the pin tucks on the front and this is linen fabric and i have that's at least <coughs> four to five yards then i have this mint like polyester fabric suiting and it's really this is like five or six yards of this fabric and the, how i get my fabric is i get it on sale at joann's when they have um the, the the clearance fabric half off like if it's four dollars end up being two so that's how i got a lot of my fabric so that's that fabric then i have this fabric here and this is a denim with some ribbon already um embellished onto the fabric and i got this print fabric from a furniture store oh some years back and it's orient it's a um oriental inspired fabric and then I was looking at this this fabric and it made me think of this dress right here. So I might be making this dress out of this fabric. So we'll see. And then I have this fabric right here, which is really cute. And this is a vintage fabric too. Everything else is not vintage, but this is definitely vintage. I'm going to make a blouse out of that. And then I have, this is some vintage fabric that someone gave to me. So what I'm going to do with this fabric is possibly make this jacket. I'm really excited about that. So hopefully I can get to making some more, some more garments soon. So some of the patterns that you guys have, I mean, I'm just going to show you the patterns I'm really trying to get, a, get um, completed using. Is this pattern here. This is Simplicity 2154. And this is um, Simplicity 4047 and this is a um older pattern I, I don't know if it's still in print it's probably be out of print and remember the Berta style dress which is um here's the number 74.94 and this vogue vintage pattern 91.56 so that's those patterns that i'm going to try to um make you definitely you know i'm going to make this dress um i already have the black um jersey that i'm going to make to you make using this dress jersey i'm going to use to make this dress and um this is some of the other fabrics that i i found you guys can see these i don't know if i'll show you this is that um what color is this it's fuchsia and i got these pieces for a dollar at this um it's called happy stop and it's a, do a dollar for whatever no less than two yards so these are like two yards each and then I got this, which is two yards. And this is a black pinstripe fabric. I don't know if you can see that well, but that's that. I'm going to make something out of that. And this is some black matte jersey, which feels really good. Oh, my gosh. I love the way this feels. And this is some black. And this, I really like this. It has, it's already crinkly, so I'm trying to make sure when I get ready to make something, I'll be real cautious when I make whatever I make out of this fabric. And you've already seen all of this. I'm not going to go through, but you can kind of see some of the fabrics. And you've seen that. So, as far as the aprons, I'm going to make me another apron. And here's some of the apron patterns that I found in my, um, my repertoire. This one, this is a Vogue uh, 8643. And this is that Brotherick uh, 3759. And that other butterick I just bought the other day, it's 50, 54, 74. And this is, um, what is it? Simplicity 2592 and Simplicity 4282. So, yeah, that's those patterns I'm going to be possibly using. And what I've been doing is trying to keep everything in a plastic bag so it's easy for me to locate what I'm going to be doing next. <clears throat> and without further ado, guess what I found? I found my fabric that I'm going to be making my quilt out of. So what I did in preparation for me getting to make the quilt, 
I measured everything. Well, I already knew how much it was. Um, some of them I already knew how much I bought. And another one I just, I know. Because I, I sew a lot. So I know what a yard looks like and what two yards look like. So without further ado. And I put it in the bag and I have to launder it. And I showed my friend. She came over yesterday and I showed her my fabric. And she really liked them. So... A sticker on this. This is two yards of fabric right here. I really like this. And you'll see the why I like all of this. It just kind of had a thing. And this is a one piece of a yard and a half. See, I marked it to mark, let myself know. And these five pieces are a yard. So we have this one here. And we have this. And we have this, and this, and this. So yeah, one, two, three, four, and five. And so if I do decide to get any fabric, it'll be a solid color. I don't know what color I'm going to do the back part of it. But what I'm going to try to do is make a king size quilt for my bed because I have a queen size bed but when I usually when I buy um comforters or spreads for my bed I like a, a king size because I like it to fall, fall all on um the sides and at the foot of the bed so that's what I was able to get accomplished so that's why I didn't get any sewing done so God willing this week I'm going to get some sewing done and usually I don't sew on Sunday so that's why I've been coming to you on Sundays doing a video because I, I have a little bit more t chance to do a little bit more do my videos because I'm not doing nothing I'm relaxing go to church relax after church chill with my grandmother or do you know family things so I pray that everybody had a blessed day know that God loves you do not forget to comment rate subscribe and I'm really enjoying your comments and just being along my journey with my sewing and um that's it. And that's all. So, good night. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe. Know that God loves you and be encouraged.